This thing is off center. Not good. There we go. And, um, I didn't plug in my controller. Hold on one second. L little bit of embarrassment. Enjoy the, uh, enjoy the main menu. Just a second. Just a second. As soon as Citra decides to respond again, might have I might have barked it. <laughs> might might have worked it a little bit. Ah, oh, how is everybody doing today? I've been doing some bug testing in, um, in Hero Sync. That uh, that was pretty extensive. Hopefully, it helps out the uh, the programmer. All right, I'm just gonna just gonna close Citra since I completely borked it. There we go. And now we're up and running. Everything's fine. Okay, so the next stage is Mescatonic University, one of my favorites. But we're um we're not gonna do that. Uh these are the uh these are the challenge things. Merciless, I think, is actually quite a bit easier than Blind Eye and No Return, but... Okay, so what I'm gonna do is... I've been talking about this rocket pack for a long time now. But I kept forgetting how to actually use it. So, I'm going to show you what the jump booster... 
and the rocket pack do together. All right, thank you, Lincoln. Thank you. Okay, so you see this fence here. It is currently impassable to, uh, let's say, Lion. See? He, he can't go high enough. He can't go high enough to cross that. So what's the point? Well, since I now have the jump booster and the rocket pack, I can get a lot of vertical height. And that lets me I've got eyes on one. just skip that entire first section of the map. There she is. So I am on this. Uh, I am on the complete other side of this fence, and now I can start to shoot a queen alien. See, this is one of the things I like about this game, is the ability to try different things out. Now, Henry would be completely by himself, which is not, uh, which is not very good at all. But that's just an example. I finally remembered how to use the rocket pack. So we will be doing Mescatonic University. If I remember correctly, it's got, um, Quickwag's not going to be the best, but we're going to bring Tom Sawyer and our good friend Pumpkin, not Pumpkin Scarecrow, and we'll bring along Tiger Lily and Henry. Actually, you know what, we'll bring Lion because uh, it's just good to... Oh, no, no. We're gonna bring Henry. Because Henry has the jump booster now. Which means he can go to very high places. Which is what we like. Which is almost, if not better, than what Lion does. Okay. Tom's got the uh, scout pack. We want that. And Scarecrow is also going to have the scout pack. We are going to give him the Meta Carbine since uh, we are going to need to split up the two teams. And someone's going to need to be able to heal on the other side. Uh, Tiger Lily, let's get you to the Patriot Boiler. That's one lower, but two plus recharge. And Tiger Lily's big... Um, Big steam costs, this is going to come in handy. And the, and the defense doesn't matter as much because she has defiance and can survive pretty much anything. Yeah, this is one just really big library. And, uh, just as a reminder, since it's been a while, I cannot slow walk at all because I am playing on the emulator, and the emulator has no idea what judging the controller means. Pull the cover. I think I might, uh, kind of close Discord and, uh, Chrome. Just to free up a couple of resources, cause getting a little, little too stall happy. Looks like they saw me. Okay, so Scarecrow's pumpkin bombs can't be put on an angled surface. But they can be put 
right here. And then maybe we can get Tom. Yep, so now... We can do that. And then I can have him reapply cover with his pumpkin bomb. Look, yeah. Highly functional. Let's do it. First couple taken care of. Scarecrow's not going to be able to do anything on Overwatch, but since he can um, fly three pumpkin bombs every turn, it makes up for it. Enemy's turn. Spotted one. We got a prowler over here. Players turn. They're on to me. Don't worry. Let's apply cover here, so if anyone's over there, we don't walk into an overwatch. Yep, see, there's a prowler there, but he's probably not going to be able to see us due to uh, the pumpkin bomb, because now he can't come this way. I think maybe Lion can come over behind the counter. I'll try to I'll try to get there with Henry, see what happens. I like large libraries. I gotta I kinda wanna have a nice library when I grow up. But when I say when I grow up, I'm already I'm already an adult. When I get older, I'd like to have a library and hopefully one that I can share like publicly. Players turn. I got one right here. You, you tried to be a rude little guy, didn't you? I'd like you to, um, 
pop your cover, if you would, my dude. There we go. Such a cool place. Oh, I know you're there. Hanging out on top of the bookshelves, huh? I got all these ceiling fans, of which um, I probably could have knocked down. Ooh. Uh, Time for action. Advertisement. A reminder to our newer students, please do not read aloud from the book of unutterable names. That, um, that does seem quite the, uh, the good idea, my dude. They spotted me. Tonight's lecture on the unknowable ones has been cancelled for inscrutable reasons. I'm thinking this place isn't all on the up and up. These coins are here simply to prevent me from laying down pumpkin bombs. Mm, creepy. Leave it to me. These paths split off pretty symmetrically. It might be a good idea to split up and cover more ground. Fantastic idea, which is why I will, um, I will be leaving this mortal coil. I wonder if I could blow this up. I can! I can blow this up, and hopefully I do not hit myself in the process. Let freedom ring. Oh yeah. There was a hidden gear here. Unfortunately, Tiger Lily can't get back there. Enemy's turn. Gotta be careful with uh, Scarecrow, since uh, he currently has no way of healing. Player's turn. I'm feeling plucky. Let's do it. I've got eyes on one. Yeah, they're like, oh, you thought you could be clever and not, uh, and not split up? No, you, you have to split up. And yeah, that guy's just sitting there on Overwatch. We're just, uh, we're gonna have Henry line up with Tiger Lily again.
I um I I once again I want I once again I once again did a bad thing and uh pressed L instead of R. There we go, there's the stun. And so that you don't get any bright ideas. Enemy's turn. Spotted one. <sighs> Saw me. Restored. All right. Do not press L. Do not press L. Now press L. I'm feeling plucky. I'm ready to do some scouting around. Tom here. I think I see one. Berserkers aren't strong. Are... Actually, they are strong. They aren't smart, but they're terrifyingly strong. The best way to fight them is from a distance. I think those guys just attack, like, whatever's in front of them. And they will, um... They will run straight into mines. Which is gonna make Tom Sawyer their best friend. Oh, you... Absolute little punk. I thought he... I thought he had a grenade launcher, not the, um... Not the other thing. You want to play there, Bucko? I'll get. I'll give you a reason to play. Enemies turn. Locked right into the mine.
Aircraft should be pretty good at taking down those guys guarding the um, the switches because, uh, due to his ability to create clever. Place is a mess. What you want me to do? Only thing unspeakable of these guys is they're absolutely atrocious. Uh, cleanliness. There's one guy down there, and then there's that other guy blocking. Oh, and here's a gear. I think that's all of them. Yeah, we already got them all. Hazing Ritual Gone Awire, members of the Bipedith Halop. Did they say that? Bipedith Scython? Vanished from Mescatonic U, along with their house. I'm um I'm I'm starting to understand what Milton was talking about when this place seemed a little bit sketch. Oh man, that was like no damage. Yep. I positively hate these guys. I'm feeling plucky. Alien sighted. Okay, yeah, this guy is gonna be an absolute punk. But so we are going to ruin his line of sight. Okay, now he shouldn't be able to see us. He doesn't go. Yeah, shouldn't go after Henry at all. Alright, let's see if we can do a combo. Oh man, so close. Alright, 
Alright, this side's taken care of. What's the plan? So now I gotta be able to deal with this guy. I'm just getting warmed up. Alright. Popped him open. That's good. And of course he shoots me. God, I hate those things so much. They are so annoying. That did the trick. Enemy Overwatch in this game is a little unfair. Simply because, one, how many times they can do it, how hard Enemy's they hit. Turn. They have the capacity to stun you when they're doing it. Alright, I'm gonna need to get up top. And then maybe I can have Henry get on top of these, uh, one of these bookshelves. And snipe the, uh, the big dudes. Now accepting submission for next year's academic symposium, the Transatlantic Tunnel, our pathway to the future. I'm not quite sure what that's referencing. Everything else in this was a Lovecraft reference, so I'm assuming this is too. I don't think it'd make a whole lot of sense to just have a random. Alright, Scarecrow, get out of the way for a second. Tom is going to uh, have a little fun. It's when these guys have uh, when these guys escape, they are going to have a, a little a little surprise in store for them. Just gotta take that guy out. Player's turn. I've been spotted. I got an idea. Uh, can I not get on top of these bookshelves? It doesn't look like it. No, it doesn't seem like it. It was a nice try. I saw that there was, um, a gap there. I thought I could maybe shoot him from an angle. Let's go ahead and save the game. Turn. I've got eyes on one. Player's turn. 
Okay, he's not moving at all. I'm just gonna have to hit him before he hits me. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's do this. Okay, Henry will what you want me to do is on the job. Okay, once once Henry gets his turn, he can go to the um player's turn. Let's do it. Go to this. Now the gates are open. And of course, more prowlers appear. Tons and tons of enemy prowlers. So that they would be like, oh, did you decide to go ahead and go towards the objective? No, we can't have that. Okay, if Henry jumps down here, he's gonna get hit with a berserker. There's one. I'm lucky. Maybe they'll leave me alone. Fortunately, I have cover to prevent them from coming up here. I got one right here. Oh, I know you're there. All right, Tom Sawyer is going to do us all a little favor and make this place littered with mines. You didn't see anything. Enemy's turn. I think I just need to hit the goal and then I can leave. They are pretty alert. Oh, nice shot. Nice shot, Henry. Looks like the Berserker didn't want to play. Player's turn. All righty. Tom is on the job. Dang it. Blew my cover. Trying to get him to aggro into range. Is he standing on a mine? Let's do it. Ugh. They know I'm here.
Uh, how can I help out Tom Sawyer? I uh, like that, I guess. Oh, they're coming. Oh, I need to get out of here as soon as possible. Players turn. I have a feeling I'll teach you all some tricks. Tom here. I think I see one. Tracking one now. <sighs> Saw me. Boom. I think I can knock this guy out. He is knocked out. I do not need to worry about him no more. Shut. They spotted me. And that guy is also knocked out. We are not going to worry about him either. We are just going to walk right by him. You see me? You see me? No, you don't. I'm out of here. Alright, so in this map, we are going to need Lion and Tom Sawyer again. And, uh... We'll bring Queequeg. We are going to have a little issue with healing, but ideally we won't need much healing. Because this is going to be, um... This is going to be a little interesting. A carbine. Nah, not that. Okay. So we had the nice library, now we have the annals section, which is very dark. Turn. This is Carter. I'm a little surrounded here and could use some assistance. Carter is hiding somewhere in here. You'd best find him before the enemy does. So it is very dark here in the back of the library. But there's also these really, really, really high bookshelf. And we can take advantage of that. There's also a lot of, um... Of what you would call... Blind angles. That's it. Let's do it. Lots of blind angles. Uh, doesn't look like the jump booster can get me straight up there. But if I get up on there, then I will be able to get on top of these library books. Quickwake is not going to have an ability to um, to jump up anywhere, so he's going to mainly be our covering blind angles, dude. Probably going to be taking a little bit of damage here at the start. Yeah, 
that. Check it out. You can see the whole library section from here. I'm not in the best location with Lion. Dang it! Blew my cover. Not sure if this is shovelable. They're onto me. It is shovelable. I can get Tom Sawyer up to the top of the bookshelves by pushing this thing over there. I've been spotted. However, I still got to deal with the hound. I've been spotted. Alien! Oh, shucks! They spotted me! It's unfortunately not the best starting area. Knock you anywhere, can I? There are a lot of ceiling fans here. Yeah, having to do this the normal way with just blind angles a lot harder. But being able to get up on here, a lot easier. Are these? No, there's no way these are shovelable. Alright, let's see what catastrophic damage we take. Enemy's turn. Oh, shucks! They spotted me! They spotted me! Did that guy? I got one right here. Uh, come on, guys! It's a little bit. It's just a little bitty bump. You seriously can't walk up that? With all these ceiling fans, but they're not really useful. Quick way I can get that. In the meantime, I should probably focus on getting Lion to the other side. I see the enemy. Alright. 
Can't fire. Can't fire penguins. I can see this guy through the cracks. jump down this way. I can jump down from up here, though. Okay, who else needs healed? Thanks for the help. Enemy's turn. I was able to get those guys out of position. That's at least an important thing. If Quick Quick could get up there, he could be shooting bombs everywhere. your horses. Okay, he's knocked out. Let's do it. Quick quick is ready. I feel swell. Thanks. Thanks for the help, partner. If I put Henry up there, he's not coming back down. Here. I've got eyes on one. Oh, you know what sounds like fun? Goodbye. American artillery. All right, that guy's stunned. That's a prowler, and it's prob 
they really should have made a better job distinguishing between the explosive ones and the ones that will just destroy you with Overwatch. Tight spaces can be a double-edged sword. What you lose in mobility, you gain in cover. Or what you gain in, um... Being able to shoot at, uh, blind angles. Alright, quick quick, I, um... I need you to destroy a box so that I can move on. You know what? That works. Alright, now we can start to move on. Okay, I don't, I don't trust this thing as far as I can throw it. So... How about mine? Enemy's turn. I'm gonna crush that. It couldn't resist. It could not resist. Players turn. All right, there doesn't seem to be anybody up above. We're going for the quick quick. Okay, let's see here. Enemy neutralized. Nailed it. Oh, I, um... I still don't have that gear. I... I didn't need that. Alright, Tom can grab it real quick. And I can probably go ahead and save my game, too. Let's go ahead and do that. We're at a good spot. Come on, are you serious right now? Reinforcements have arrived. Leave it to me. Hostile here. Seriously? Ugh. Thank you. 
And of course the Ripper knows exactly where I am. Because I literally can't hide from it. Uh, well, that is, is that actually going to hit, though? I don't think it is. I don't, I don't see a damage bar on him. Now will it hit? It will. Uh, he's stunned, so I think this might kill. Yep. Alright, good show, good show. I'm just going to have Henry pointed right at this thing, so if it decides to... If it decides to ruin my day, I'm just going to ruin its day. I kind of wish I still had that mom that Henry had, because then I could have just blown up the Prowlers. And I wouldn't be dealing with all this nonsense. this and I don't think it'll do a lot of damage though enemies turn yep you just stay right there alien sighted Where do you come from? Even more reinforcements. I said I really liked this uh the stage. I don't like it very much anymore. I got one right here. Oh, I know you're there. Even more guys. Oh, I know you're there. Can't even hit him, but he can probably hit me. Uh. There's a ceiling fan. There is a ceiling fan. Oh, they spotted me. All, all right. 
That wasn't very good. Okay, they all hit the, uh, they all hit the books. So that didn't work. At all. No way I can get around this. No, I'm here to you. I'd very much just like to take out this guy and that old. Let's do it. This is Henry. I've got a contact. That'll make everything a little less stronger. You're making me mad, die. Tom needs to not get hit. Otherwise, I'm going to have a bad time. I've been found out. I see you. Just reinforcements, just lots and lots of reinforcements. So much damage. They know I'm here. Alien. Alright, between Tom Sawyer and Lion, I might be able to clear out these two guys. Player's turn. I'm getting rather too acquainted with the enemy's scent now. Thank you, Carter. Nice still when we have one gear. We're going farther quickly. I see the enemy. Uh I see you! 
Everyone's just having the worst time. I'm gonna have to end up seeing one of those uh, respawn things. In fact, I might just I might just revert my save because this is awful. right there. Lions. Lions not gonna have a good time unless I have like Henry last off in front of him. Okay, there's a gear. There's no way for me to get to lion. No hiding now. Doesn't look like it. Alright, if this goes poorly, I'm just gonna revert my save and start over clearing these guys out before I do anything else. Alright. Plane ran away. Ooh, that's gonna leave a mark. Ooh, my armor's almost shot. Alien. Yeah. Okay. I'm. I'm just gonna revert my save because this is. They just throw all the reinforcements at you if you so much as try to uh, to push forward ahead of time. They're like, no. No, what are you doing? Like, you haven't taken care of all these people. Yeah, see? Nobody here. Just trying to get a gear. That's That's all I'm doing. Craig's moving forward. Lions just doing lion stuff. We're all just we're all just hanging out. What's going on? We're all just we're all just hanging out right now. Turn. Summons four guys, and then on the next turn, summoned another four guys. Do they think I'm made of steam? This 
is Henry. I've got a contact. All right, we're gonna take this nice and easy. Just gonna watch you like a hawk. We're just gonna wait until these guys are done. And then we're going to move on with our life. Where does this guy come from? Players turn. It just appeared out of nowhere. Oh, is he stunned? Leave it to me. We quit getting ready. Uh Yeah, that Ripper's probably going to be over here in a second. I've got eyes on one. Enemy neutralized. Spotted one. You don't see anything. You just go about your business now. Enemies turn. See, I don't have to worry about any any quadruple reinforcements. Okay, now now they're coming. I've got eyes on one. One, Henry. You've got eyes on six. Okay. We're going to the quick, quick. Tom will teach you all some tricks. Okay, I can't have Tom jump down without getting utterly eviscerated. Okay. How are we going to deal with this? I guess the best way to would be to climb up through there with Tom. 
However, I'd still have to deal with the four guys. Or, I'd have to deal with all the guys that have identical leverage on me. Okay, well, we'll just hold Tom here for right now. Is just gonna hang out here. Enemy's turn. I've been spotted. The enemy stay close. Spotted one. All right, that's that's a good position to get double penguin. Come from players turn. The guy's just coming out of the freaking wall. Keep going on and on about how I like this game, and then these freaking prowlers come out here and call me a liar. Okay, I... I jumped down. I still gotta deal with those guys at the moment. Let's try to take out this guy. Got him. And let's try to take out this guy. Nice and easy indeed. Okay, Tom can probably jump down now. I'll lay down a couple mines. And hopefully they run into him. Dang it! Blew my cover. I am uh I have one two few mines. So let's uh let's improve upon that. They can trip him up. Alright, that's a lot of mines. Hopefully they run into them. I should at least have their attention by now. Yep, I have their attention. And this one should also come for the mines. Yes. Yep. Me. 
Alright, those grenade guys ain't doing nothing. Alright. Let's blow you gentlemen up. Goodbye. Alright, Henry. You big baby. That's great. Thanks. Well, I'm ready to do some scouting around. Yeah, I'm just gonna take all that. Do that, gonna do that. I can't get up from that side. I need to get up from this side. This is Henry. I've got a contact. Lion has so much mobility on this map, it's crazy. Enemy's turn. They're on to me. Again, guy just comes from nowhere. Are they coming from, like, the back or something? I have no idea. Get on over there, buddy. Alright. He spoke. Okay, that should almost be everybody. Henry, so he can have some steam for when he gets up there. going up there, a lion can go up there. I need to grab this. Alright, now Henry can get up there. Hostile here. 
And we got enough for a shot. Very nice. I'm pretty sure that wouldn't kill with um, the normal damage that he does. Alright, that's a good uh, quick wag. Does anyone need healing? Yeah, a lot of people need healing. It's a darn good thing I just healed Tom Sawyer because he just took like 31 damage or 73 damage. Gotta stay sharp. They know I'm here. I can't see this guy very well. You mess with Tom Sawyer, you get the punch gun. Stay away. Where's my prey? Fine, buddy. Come on. You, you, you got to be able to get up there. can't get up there that way, but it can get up there that way. Okay, where's this last gear? What I want to know. One there. just barely not hit the ceiling even though he clips through the ceiling okay there's the boss
think that's the only way that it can get in or get to me is right there. We're just gonna do that, hold back. Okay, let's jump down. Grab that. Get that. Yeah, there's Carter, and there's the other gear. Alright. That means I can get out. Sometimes it only looks like a dead end. Other times, depending on what you packed, you have to go the long way around. Like right here, I have Lion. So this is in fact not a dead end. Uh, not a dead end. I can... I can get through the cracks here. Okay, maybe not. Yeah, I guess I can't get through the cracks here. I'll just have to wait until I can get rid of some of that trash. Enemy's turn. Player's turn. Ah, uh, hey, this guy strapped himself into a corner. Means he can do nothing but run into bombs if he actually wants to do anything. Or he can just shoot Henry. That's always an option. Enemies turn. My armor's almost Nice and easy. There better not be some guys coming up behind Henry.
I still can't weave through the gaps here. Hi, Carter. There he is. Just, uh... Just sit there a moment. I have a gear to get. Okay. Alright, let's get you out of this place. You're a bit later than I would have liked, but I'm still alive, and that counts for something. Thank you. Well done, Agents. Now... Get him to the Liberty as quickly as you can. Mission complete. Victory. Hey, okay, not a bad score, to be honest. Now here's a ugly looking guy. An elder thing, or uh I guess I guess we're calling it a star face, but it, it's an elder thing. Giant dragon elder things. What a fun day. So you're saying the monsters were not simply after your research? No, they sought the Necronomicon itself. What the heck's a Necromanticon? I'll tell you when you're older. The Book of Power. It's real? Indeed. And until recently, it was kept safe at Miskatonic. Just how powerful are we talking? Hard to say. We've only deciphered a handful of fragments. But those fragments alone have led to innumerable discoveries. Discoveries? You mean like dark science? Indubitably. My research has led to countless improvements on existing technologies. But you said they weren't after the research. What makes the book so special? The knowledge it contains goes beyond mere science. This plot is so ridiculous. From other worlds, mystic formulae, and more. Incredible! So it's like a field guide to outer space. In a sense, and if our enemy is after it, it must contain some knowledge critical to their plans. So they must not find it. Where do books stay now? Sixteen hundred Pennsylvania Avenue. Huh? Isn't that... Set course for Washington, D.C. So you're keeping the Necronomicon in the White House? Clever. It's hidden in a secure vault. Trust me, the enemy won't find it. We'll arrive shortly, sir. We should coordinate with the units leading the counterattack. Militia from both Maryland and Virginia have been called in. A pincer attack from the north and south should distract the enemy. Making our job easy as swinging a hammer. Mr. President, look. It's some sort of veil of energy drawn across the site. A barrier protecting the base they're building in the Potomac River. In the very heart of our capital. Reckon that's gonna take one big hammer. The heavier the hammer, kid, the harder it falls. 
Sir, it looks like there's a path through the perimeter over there. Very well. Full steam ahead. I like that it uses the steam acronym, but it makes absolutely no no sense to be using it in that form there. Whatever the barrier is, the Liberty is powerless to bypass it. I need you to find whatever it is generating that barrier and destroy it. Best of luck. Thanks to you and your team, Randolph is an active duty agent again. Randolph's unspeakable lure irresistibly draws aliens' attention for a turn. Some enemies will even make a beeline for it. Its weapon of choice is odd. It can't be shooting what I think it's shooting, can it? Where I come from, that is not the way guns are meant to behave. But I think you'll find Randolph's expertise very useful in the field. Unfortunately, it's not all good news. We need you to bring that bar bring down that barrier. I have faith that you'll be able to turn that into good news as well, Captain. Oh, the capital! Oh, I've missed it. But who would could have imagined the circumstances of our return? An enemy in the heart of the U.S. government. Why? It hasn't happened in 50 years. And that enemy being from beyond the stars. I'm fairly certain that's unprecedented. I find the situation most upsetting for a variety of reasons. But I have faith that this August group will ultimately triumph over our foe. And my confidence is only increased now that Professor Carter is here. A man of such learning will surely be a welcome addition to our ranks. I mean... Obviously, we already had me, of course. But regrettably, I cannot join you in the battlefield. My duty is to guard this library against any attack, no matter the risk to myself. I've often read of the black goat to the woods with a thousand young, but I long assumed it a metaphor. Now that I have seen the necessity of these extraordinary beasts, it seems a mere thousand was a substantial understatement. These fascinating creatures supposedly inhabit the corners of time while we inhabit its curves. Questionable application of fourth dimensional physics aside, these creatures remain deadly adversaries. I do not believe in Shub Nuggeth could give birth to anything more grotesque than the slasher. It appears I have underestimated these monstrosities once again. Team's first assignment was stamping out the shadow that had fallen over the town of Innsmouth. The report describes creatures similar in many ways to this prowler. Could they be related? Even the thought of their gaze trans turned upon me transforms my blood into ice water. Are they mere fractions of a larger whole penetrating our reality from beyond? Perhaps the ancient belief that gods and demons watch our every move started with these things. This nightmarish grotesquity reminds me uncannily of the iconography of the esoteric order of Dagon, the curious quasi-religion found in Innsmouth, Massachusetts. Members of that cult are given to practices best left undescribed, so the connection is disturbing at best. A passage in the Necronomicon mentions a creature I can only describe as a blind vampire. For some reason, despite what my own eyes have seen already, I cannot believe in the existence of vampires. Perhaps if I were to attain a specimen. Living would be preferred, of course. On close examination, it was easy to discern that these creatures have yet to fully develop. I pray that we can end the war before they mature into their final no melt no some form. Additional samples will be needed for further analysis. 
I've uncovered evidence that this so-called scourge was once worshipped by early humans as an elephant or mammoth deity. It's unnerving to imagine the influence these creatures have had throughout human history. Has this world truly never been our own? Tissue analysis reveals that even small fragments of the creature are imbued with independent life. Though these samples lack higher consciousness, they respond to external stimuli. Perhaps they remain under the control of something beyond our instrument's meager sensitivities. In dreams, I once found myself wandering through the Vale of Paneth, where I was nearly killed by one of these horrors. I am almost relieved to see them here in the waking world, where I have the means and technology to destroy them myself. Perhaps a little vivisection is called for. The lost continent of Mew was replendent with worshippers of the Black Goat of the Woods with a thousand young. These aliens could be described as minor manifestations of that awful, deitless, fearsome. Perhaps. But not by much. This entity seems to be made less of flesh than a pure rage. It has been observed when no foes are in reach to destroy whatever inanimate objects are nearby. It turns a bloody crimson when attacked, stoking its furor further. Once, when I was a young man, I dreamt of abandoned Kandeth, the city ancient gods once called home. It was there that I first encountered a race of monsters that looked almost exactly like these beings. How could they have found their way from my dream world to the real one? So if you haven't guessed, Randolph Carter is the protagonist of H.P. Lovecraft's works as Randolph Carter, who is somewhat of a self-insert, and these are his connections to the, his Lovecraftian works. Drawing the connection as to what these monsters are supposed to be, such as the, uh, the very obvious uh, Black Goat of the Woods with a Thousand Young, who uh, is a hor horrible, grotesque monster with an axe-like tail. Randolph Carter has always been a dreamer with his head in the clouds as much of his books. Professor at Mescatonic University, he spends more time with the Necronomicon than he does with any living human. His research has contributed directly to the most advanced technology of this age. While I certainly appreciate the considerable body of esoteric knowledge Carter has amassed, I wonder if another field of study would be had a less worrisome effect on him. He worsens daily. You, uh, you can only pierce the veil of reality for so long before it begins to affect you. The book we have based... The book we have is based on an original Arabic work called Al-Afasi. It was translated and renamed in Greek sometime in the 10th century. Oh, this is a near-perfect copy of that first Necronomicon. Used incautiously, this knowledge could potentially lead to humanity's extinction. To keep it away from the less careful, we hid the book in our most secure vault. Of course, I never imagined the possibility of a hostile force occupying Washington. What's more, if the capital is destroyed, the nation will never recover its morale. As president, I must take personal responsibility in this situation. I humbly ask for your help in correcting my mistake. Disgraceful as it is, we'll have to sneak into the White House. After we've won the war, I promise you'll all be welcome through the front door. Alright, alright. 
we are halfway through this game now. Because we um, we get three cogs a level. And we have 48 and twice that is 96, which is all cogs. So we are about halfway through the game. Still plenty of additional weapons to find those sub-weapons. All right, it is nine o'clock. There are two maps to this mission. Fight your way through the ferocious berserkers and destroy the generator, creating that energy barrier. Let's see. Uh, advanced weak points. Under the gun. Gun tactics work quickly. The alien scourge stealth tactics. Path not taken. Blah 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 blah. We're going to be able to do one of my favorite combinations here soon, which is use Randolph Carter, Scarecrow, and then uh, Quick Bag or John, and you can just take out a whole bunch of enemies that way. But we're going to we're going to hold off on that. We are instead going to raid my friend Lyra. Because I would like to be done for today. That map was seriously bothersome, but I did enjoy it to a degree. Yeah, I was like, oh, this is one of my favorite maps, and then I and then I just spent so much time complaining about that second map because of the reinforcements just being silly. But it is what it is, and we'll get him next time. We're on our way. We'll get it done. <laughs>